This is a single brass fastener pin. It's 100 years old. These are the pins that held together the military service records of each Canadian soldier who served in the First World War. When Library and Archives Canada began their mass digitization of soldiers' files, each of these pins had to be detached by hand. In total, there were 640,000 of them. Nobody knew what to do with all this brass, and so they asked an artist. I wanted to do something with these fasteners that would preserve their meaning as historical artifacts, but they would also find a respectful way to convey the magnitude of human loss during these conflicts. Each fastener is stamped with a star, and there's unmistakable military symbolism attached to the gold star when you think about the sacrifice that these families have made. And it was that that gave me my inspiration for this. I started by focusing on the five major battles of the First World War that involved the Canadian Expeditionary Force. After determining the geographical coordinates of each of these battles, Hatton generated star maps of what the skies would have looked like on the nights following each of these major conflicts. Then, she got to work. The result is a series of star charts titled Detachment. These pieces show us exactly how the stars appeared 100 years ago. The first night after the fighting was over. The skies that, no doubt, the surviving soldiers would have been looking up at. This series is a tribute to peace, sacrifice, timelessness, and remembrance. Regardless of your political view, stars are a cross-cultural constant that we look to for direction, whether that's spiritual or navigational. They're a universal way that we recognize and memorialize the fallen.